Hello guys, Joshua, welcome to another episode of Dying Light 2. And today, we're kind of things off last episode, kind of with the main story, obviously. And I think Aiden? we're helping, yeah, Sophie. Susie? You there? Sophie, Something about phones, I think. What? Susie, what's going on? It was a trap! Run! I'm not too sure, though. Fuck! God. They've got all the crystals, everything we have. Oh, because I'm somewhere right behind us. Okay, I, I think it's something to do with thugs. But I could be mistaken. Um, it was just there a minute ago. Yeah, thugs. And this is it. Because it's an inhibitor as well somewhere. It's probably going to be below. Maybe. Normally, like they're just in buildings, like random buildings. So maybe it might be in here. Ah, uh, it's looking like a no. So I don't really know where that inhibitor could be. But I mean, anyways, it's kind of the main quest. I don't know what that sound was behind us, but I'm just gonna keep running. Like I was through a Fortnite back accent. Uh, I see bandits. Oh, and a lot of bodies. Sophie, I'm sorry. I knew it! I knew those motherfuckers would betray us! Fuck them, Aiden! Kill them all! So we're killing these boys then. Is that what's happening? Kill Jack and Joe Stoops. <laughs> yeah, I was... No more left. Come on, jackass. Anyway, I've got good weapons, so. Nailed it. Show me two. I'm not gonna like two hit them. Oh. Bro. I actually stopped them. I made it. Probably will sell more. No, 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 no. Find the crystals. Susie? Carl. They, they took Carl. What? Where? <sighs> to their camp. We, we must... Susie? Susie, where are the crystals? Susie? Well, Susie is dead. Sophie, I found Susie. She's dead. I can't believe it. First birdie, now her. There's nothing you could have done. No. Except that I sent them there. Joe's men have kidnapped Carl. And I don't see these crystals. Oh, you are joking. Fuck him. What? The goon. Huge, ugly motherfucker. He's slow. Just be careful. Search the other bodies, Aiden. Maybe the crystals are still there. Do I kill this guy or what? What's happening? Bro, are you tripping? <laughs> These guys just spawned in about one of them, apparently. Bro, why are the search attacks so long as well? Nah, wait, this. So you gotta come, just all infected, apparently. These goons weren't exactly the smart, so let's be honest. So they have got weapons, like I said. Hmm. Yeah. I will be absolutely done for right now. Yeah, searching text. About 100 years. I can't even be honest. Oh, actually, his mouth's really bad. Yeah. One thing I can really figure right now is... Okay, I'm not too sure if you actually can reanimate them or not. Right, apparently so, he's, so 100 zombies just casually chilling right here. Maybe if I can, where's he at? Hold the ignite and throw so him. See if I'll do anything. Yeah. 
Uh, this guy just keeps. Get some more people. more re going. Sophie. Yes, yeah, not here. Everything's been taken. Probably took him before you got there. Everything has gone wrong. All right. Enough of this playing defense. Okay, I've got a new weapon to put there as well. Um, struggle that hammer, because why not? by Jack and Joe's camp on the roof by the overpass. We're gonna go after Carl and our crystals. Okay. Jack and Joe will pay for this shit show. The red. Gonna have a thrown spear, might as well throw it you right now. Have it. Aiden, how's it going? You alive, man? <laughs> Fuck, I'm getting sentimental. I haven't said that to anyone since my third divorce. I appreciate it, but don't get your hopes up. Not the marrying kind. Learn anything about the commander's murder? I heard Sophie's brother mention something about Lucas's death. That's all so far. Let's go, yeah. Now they have a bigger problem. The bandits you mentioned? Three minutes. They took Carl hostage. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, exactly. I'm helping Sophie get him back. Good. Gain her trust. That might also help us find out what they know. Just watch out. They might be suspicious. Nice boys. But if you can do it, Ator will let us into the center. Wait, is that a bolter? Yeah, it was. Okay, I quickly search his bolter. Rare. I'm hoping it's like an hour per minute. That means I can survive this. Just for good measure though, might as well pop this. Then man as UV light, that's actually saved my, my stuff. Hey Herman. It's like Where's I never speak on God. Hey, why were you on the mission? Friends could have used you. Okay. I guess that means I should wait here. Take me back, back at the, uh, the old hospital thing, the GRE hospital. <clears throat> yeah, I think that's the door. What we saw Mia and Aiden as kids. Mia? Yeah. Okay, just don't do the same as Outlast, but just. Something shocking stuff. Mia? Even Resident Evil, you know, these like dark hallways. Always give off the Mia, horror game you? vibes. Yeah, the hopscotch thing. I recognize that, but I don't know where from. Oh, no. 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 Come fire. I can't sprint. Follow the voice. <laughs> Wait, what? Jack and fucking Joe will pay for what they did. I had a bad feeling about it from the start. I had a feeling Carl's plan sucked. And yet I let him lead. Um. You think Jack and Joe could have had something to do with Lucas's murder? Joe, perhaps. He's a total psycho and a thief. He knew the peacekeepers would hang him if they caught him. But Jack wouldn't let him. He's a coward. He thinks rationally. Okay, um, Why didn't you send Herman on the mission? They wouldn't have stood a chance against that beast. Him? He's strong, but as helpless as a child. 
It's one damn big child. You don't understand. Herman's almost deaf. He used to be my mother's bodyguard. He's been around us as long as I can remember. And after she died, he stayed close to us. One time, the lights in my shelter went out. The infected broke through a window. Herman blocked the path and tossed a grenade into a nearby infected. He survived the explosion, but lost his hearing. In a face-to-face -face battle, he's nearly unbeatable. But if he's caught from behind, he's as vulnerable as a child. A killer combination, especially for him. That's why I prefer to keep an eye on him. Sometimes I wonder if he's watching over me, or I'm watching over him. Don't beat yourself up. Things could have been worse, too. If I had listened to myself, we'd have water, and more of our people would still be alive. You were just doing your job. You were following Carl's lead. Yeah, but I won't let him lead the bazaar to its doom. I see. All right, so what's the plan now? From now on, I'm following my gut. Last time something like this happens on my watch. If you'd hurried back there, maybe some of our guys would have made it. I thought a pilgrim like you was supposed to run like a fucking gazelle. Barney, shut up! What? If he'd have made it in time to help, we'd be having a party. Not a wake. Well, I don't see you doing in things, Mama. change your mind. He can be a real pain in the ass. But we'll do something good for the city one day. Yikes. Birdie, to your help. Okay, now what am I? I'm just going to. Okay, um. I gather you were close with Birdie. He tried to be a poet, kept showing me his work, and said all the other guys were too stupid to understand. I never told him how bad it was. He was a good kid. I took him into the group when he lost his father in a dark zone. He was 10 years old. That's pretty young. Too young. But he had no one else. So I took him in. If you manage to take out those bandits, it... Jack Cock and Joe Cunt. You think killing Messrs. Cock and Cunt will change something? Death usually changes a lot in a person's life. Carl was wrong. We should have gone after them right away. But right or wrong, we have to help him. He's one of us. We'll rescue him and retrieve the crystals from Jack and Joe. Besides, I won't let them get away with killing my people. Ralph, Susie, Logan, Birdie, they deserve revenge. And Jack and Joe sentenced them to death. So they'll die. Your radio. Yeah, it picks up static sometimes. Go see Alberto. He can fix stuff like that on the spot. Thanks. Okay, isn't Alberto the guy from the... Bizarre. Hey, Tor here. Leave, but make sure no one sees you. You two make a pretty pair, Aiden. I'm on the roof nearby. We have to talk. Now. It's about saving your life. Okay. I'll tear them apart. I swear. I'll gut them. Real slow. Okay, I can piece speak to you, but I can't speak to you. Piece. To Ralph, Susie, and Bertie, to our crew. Okay, I probably can't speak to you, even though there's an exclamation mark with it. Why would he mind all loop? <sighs> oh, yeah, this guy is a peacekeeper, so I'm, I know why we can't let them see us. Well, okay, can we talk to her now? No commissions over here. Bro, there's no way you just watch it from a distance. No way. Hopefully we can get a um, slide quite soon as well. Defeat, defeat, defeat. Three defeats will... Oh god. <laughs> I'm not supposed to do that at all. Oh, 
Okay, fuck it. Oh. I don't know what I'm got on this issue with my life here. That's slowly going up as well. Cheers. Bro, in and climb. What are you doing? Where's it? Where's this guy even? Oh, I went completely past him. I'll take eggs from me. Either way, we're actually inside of a UV zone now as well. What do you want? I don't like what's going on here, Aiden. First, Jack and Joe's bandits killed Carl's people. Now Sophie's getting ready to retaliate. You're not a part of that, are you? But you said you wanted me to get close to them. I'm gonna search Sophie's camp. That's why I came to warn you. Rumors have started. You found the Lazarus for me. They may suspect you of being a PK spy. You came here just to warn me? You helped me with the Lazarus. And I take care of my allies. Sophie's just fighting for water, that's all. I don't think she suspects anything. <laughs> you think so? She hates the peacekeepers. She blames us for not helping the bazaar. And for her mother's death. So when we start questioning her people, you better be careful. Thanks for the warning. You gain any intel for our investigation? Sophie's also wondering who killed Lucas. What else would she say? They know if we can prove they killed Lucas, it'll be a bloodbath. Find out from Sophie when she's planning the attack. Keep me informed where you are. Be careful. Take care of yourself, Pilgrim. Well then. So we've got another mission optional. Join the party over there. Um, we shall probably do next episode to be honest. Don't trust I the people don't really know how long I've been recording for. More dangerous than they seem. But we'll finish this mission off. Let's quickly get to the roof. We're also quite close, so I think it was a combat skill point. It might have been parkour, not really too sure to be honest. Oh well, no, it was quite close to one. Uh, but we have an activate windmill. How do I get up here? Climb said little chimney thing. Okay, so that move would be, be fast enough, I'll turn us. That's moving rapid. Okay, the punch go down again, okay, that's good to know I guess. Got to this one now. Then just onto it. Okay, boom boom. Um Up we go, nice. Cause it's another windmill done. Uh, it's gonna be survivors or peacekeepers? That's the question. Not really too sure. It didn't. Really see him? Yeah. There we go. That's it all. Is it fine down? Quickly search all this stuff. As well, uh, I think it's just PlayStation. It could be Xbox as well. But I can get. I, I've got some free stuff from PlayStation. Access, it should be just in here, I think. Extras. So there's these weapons. So two from pre order bonus. And then this one right here from the Authority Pack, part three out of three. That's what I got. And uh, the rest of them, I don't think I've got anything else new to be honest. Grappling, because we've got grappling again. There is a paraglider. I'm not too sure how, how to use a par uh, paraglider. But you've got a 38 damage weapon, which is nice. Other than that, I 
Okay, so let me see what happens. Hey, have you seen Sophie? Sophie? Uh, yes, she went. Uh, she said, uh, uh, she went that way. Exactly. Thanks. Wait. There's more. One more thing. Something's wrong with the. Uh, not working with the. It's broken. That. Uh, oh. Dad's asking if there's something wrong with your radio. Oh, uh, it hisses sometimes, but as long as it works, no point messing with it. Um, can I ask you a question? Sure. Call me Aiden. Vincenzo. Uh, Aiden? How do you become a pilgrim? Does that mean you're a murderer? Vincenzo! Why? You want what money? do you... I'll give you money. Why Just would you... Go. Dad, I'm asking because I'm curious. Will you tell me, Aiden? Um... I'm not that exciting. I've had to kill people, but I'm not a murderer. All being a pilgrim is to me now is a means to an end. To what end? Vincenzo, leave him alone! To find the only family I've ever known. Did you? Not yet, but I might be close. I hope you succeed. I've never found Federico. Who? Federico. He was my best friend. We were like brothers. We'd known each other forever. He disappeared like the other kids because of those fucking tests. Tests? You mean GRE tests? You heard that when they built the walls, they were trying to create a vaccine here? It all fell apart in a couple of weeks. One day, Federico vanished into thin air. We'd been playing football. I went to my house after that. He went home too. And I never saw him again. I'm sure they took him. And that's not all. You see, he wasn't the only child who went missing that winter. There were others? Two girls disappeared from the building next door I'm guessing at the same time. Maybe, maybe. And more, all across if the I city. Can. And none of them have ever been found? No, but based on what Federico's mother said, I have a feeling I know what happened. Federico had been in the hospital a month earlier with pneumonia. His mother was told that some GRE doctor had ordered blood tests, but they wouldn't tell her why. A week after he was released from the hospital, he was gone. Do you remember this doctor's name? No one knew, and no one at the hospital would say. Only that he was on classified GRE business. Then, everything went to hell. The GRE collapsed. After that, some of the kids were sighted in the central loop. But, not Federico. Every day, I wonder what happened to him. I hope he's alive. And that you find him someday. Got a little bit of extra information, I guess. That Sophie's here now. Okay. Again, you ought to talk to you, but I can't talk to you. But she's back now. I'm here. How's your radio? Working now? Sometimes it works. Sometimes, no. Roll the dice. Susie, Logan. I swear I'll tear them apart and eat the pieces! Bertie! Ralph! To your help! I love you. What now? Do you remember the beginning of the fall, Aiden? <laughs> Vaguely. I remember it as if it were yesterday. We'd been defending the church against infected for some time. My mother was in charge. She was losing dozens of people every day. She was keeping everyone alive while I was keeping an eye on Barney. She begged the peacekeepers for help. But they ignored her. Eventually, she was injured. It was dawn. They led me to her. To the roof of the sacristy. She saw me and made me promise to look after my brother. <laughs> she said it as if she was lending me a car and asking me to have it returned intact. 
After that, she appointed Carl as her successor, with me at his side. You'll grow up to be a far better leader than Carl, she said. But while the world is burning, people won't listen to someone so young. She was wrong. I've been thinking like that all my life. But not anymore. Now I understand, my mother. You have to be ruthless to be a leader. I wasn't ready then. Okay, she was talking I now. I am now. I think I know what you're talking about. lips not moving. And I know what loss is like. Talking about someone in particular? <laughs> about my sister. I'm sorry. Yeah, maybe you don't have to be. We'll find out. That's why you came to town. For her. Yeah. Sophie, we have to talk. Time to act. The quicker we do this, the less prepared Jack and Joe will be. Aiden. Aiden. And we started on the wrong foot. A sip of courage. Should you be drinking this much before the mission, Barney? Me? <laughs> I got the toughest liver in Philidor. Worry more about yourself, Pilgrim. Where's Sophie? There. On the rooftop. I'm watching you, Pilgrim. <laughs> how did you get down there so fast? Like, what? Okay, one's car. Get some enemies there. Just leave me alone, boys, if you don't mind. They must be blind, to be honest, but I mean, it's whatever. Apparently, the peacekeepers are watching us. Well, let them see what happens to Jack and Joe, and that we can do it to them too. Well, you said it was time to act. We're acting. I sent three scouts towards the camp. Carl and the crystals must be somewhere inside the building. Okay. Bandit camps. Uh, use your binoculars to identify entry points, locate the camp leader, and identify potential environmental opportunities. Uh, you need to kill camp leader and his lieutenants, and then claim the uh, camp flag tower. When you claim a tank, tank, the camp, you'll establish a safe zone and earn more additional rewards. XP, weapons, outfits, etc. Right, so quickly. Uh, guards. Most are probably asleep. There are a few entrances to the camp. The front one, suicide. Yeah. It's got the most guards. You go in first. We'll move in from the other side, and then we'll catch them in a pincer movement. If anything goes wrong, we retreat to our base. Where? The Tango Motel. I mean, I didn't exactly get a chance to fully uh, explore the use of the rockers, you know what I mean? Okay, there's a little airdrop up there. I mean, so there's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. About oh, 15 guards, roughly. The question is, where do I want to get him from? Is that just one guard there? Change of plans, Aiden. Stealth. Okay, um, coins, balls, sneak by enemies. They attacked our safe house. Who? Sophie? You have my men there. Find Carl. Save him and get our crystals. Fast. I'll do what I can. Okay, I'm gonna try stealth as uh, much as possible. And... Ooh. What the shit? Watch yourself, brother. Uh, it's might as well use the damage hacks all I know. Which way is he about to go? Left or right? Just don't turn now, please. Get <coughs> search. Okay, 
get a coin. People did. Only like 30 more to go. There's a guy down there. Okay, all of them are infected actually, so that's all good. Try and get behind this guy before he ends up moving. Ah, it's one of them uh, bell people as well, the top of reinforcements. Okay, there's another bell up there as well. I thought we've got hide and we can just check everything that we need to check. Imagine if I like fully stealth this for like, first time, that'd be quite mad to be honest. Um I have to go one more level up for this little zip line. I should go one more level up actually never mind. I think we won't go for you. And then Let's use a zipline and get over there. Okay, he's down there. I mean, there's two right there. I'm not too sure I'm gonna get down there to be honest. Actually, there's three of them. I think I think if he goes behind there, hop down, stuff that guy, walk around, kill that guy, then kill this guy right there as well. That's how I'm, I'm thinking we do this. But he's walking that way as well. That's kind of ruins it to be honest. But again, like, he, he might walk back this way. I'm not really too sure where his path just yet. If only I like, had like speed or something, I can just throw at them. Be a lot more useful. Let's try this one. You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> and boom. Better keep alert, I guess. I was about to go for it there as well. What a tragedy. Are you kidding me? Who do we have? Hey, you saw nothing there, bro. Absolutely nothing. I wonder if I can stealth take down the boss. I 
And does the boss even move? Once this guy goes back there, kill him, kill the boss, hopefully with a stealth takedown, kill a guy, and then kill a guy last. Okay, just don't walk over, over here, please, bro. Are you serious, friend? Wasn't supposed to do that, turn on I must be going crazy. <laughs> oh my god, you won. <laughs> that boss was straight does not move at all. Nothing gets past me. I'm not your boss. Now I'm hoping we can stop this lieutenant. If not, it's going to be a bit of a problem to us. Something's not right. You gotta be kidding. Who is that? Oh, you, you, you want to stop it? Zabro. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Well, my guy kind of moves fast enough. Hey there, jackass! Oh. You gotta do nothing on that soft. Trust me, bro. Don't this, motherfucker! Wait, is he even that strong to us? Okay, and then... So two's this. Uh... Okay, let's do this. And then... So this is number two, so we need to liberate the, liberate the actual thing. Liberate the camp. Okay, nice. This is how we're now, right? Got a skill as well. Let's do the probably the. Can see the perfect dodge because that's grapple throw and grapple are both useful. Right, um, as well as, actually, if we could do, go in here, it's not my valuables, not really a lot of valuables. 29, 30, 33, you know. Might buy that as well, just to have an extra weapon on, on hand. Right, so there was a supply drop, which I have to go right to the roof to get. Not too sure how to actually get up on the roof, but I mean, I suppose, up the there, right? Um, that quite clear wasn't the win. Again, it might be because I was thinking like looks sort of like ladders, the way I, like, the the laid out. Okay, so we can climb right to the top of that. We can go out over here though. Can we get over there somehow? Not the way. Um, actually, this is the way. Actually, up there. Then we can get to the roof up here. Okay, there's two ways. I'm guessing we can do a jump up there. Unless that's jump there, then up that way. So we might have to go this way, maybe. And then use these little. These little things to move on. Bro, there's no way I'm making that jump. Okay, it wasn't a jump, just common sense, walk inside the building. Yikes. Okay, it's, it's always these ones I, I, I hate doing. Like, you have to like, keep the, like, the left stick still as possible. 
and then do these little monkey bar looking things. Okay, nice and easy actually, nice and easy. Then boom, boom, and then hop onto the other one, boom. Nice and easy too fair. Little drop as well. I can't remember what's actually in these drops. It's been that long since I have actually opened one. Other than that. Parkour a thousand. Military tech. To improve your tools, go to Craftmaster. To upgrade your tools. Okay, is it Craftmaster here, right chan? Oh no! Bloody hell. Yeah, you know, I might actually be able to hop down here kinda. That's just a trade guy, there's no actual... I'm guessing I have to go to the bazaar then. To actually... Yeah. Let's do this again. Yeah, it's looking like there's no... Oh, thanks. Free call. Okay, we'll do it next episode, as well as upgrade with the uh, military thing. So, free call. Yeah, we'll do this next episode. Um, so, if you guys did enjoy, please do smash the like button. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.